Hey, what is up, Zeddy Neddy, and welcome to a, another episode of the Fulham career mode. And a big difference has changed. My mop has gone. <laughs> haircut done. Right, okay, let's go take an Arsenal at home. It's going to be a difficult game. They're a good side, Arsenal, obviously. Uh, we didn't have the best of end towards the last episodes. We beat up some great results, but unfortunately losing to Southampton was a little bit frustrating. But now we're going to be taking on Arsenal here, who are a very good team. A lot of changes, though. Look at their start 11, like Araujo, um, Orban, obviously Turam. So quite a few new players. But anyway, let's get in this game versus Arsenal and hopefully we continue our decent run of form in terms of the Premier League because we still are, you know, above mid-table, but we're still not, you know, perfect where I want us to be yet. Bad change right there from Tossin. It's going to be a yellow card right there for the former C. I've been really impressed with Tossin. Him and Diop have been, I think, a real good uh, back partnership, but that was quite poor. And Arsenal got themselves a free kick. They're going to whip this ball in. We've conceded already quite a few times set piece. Instead, they're going to lay it off. Lay it off one more. Araujo. Moving it round, Arsenal. It's going to be a good chance now. Edge of the box. Nice play so far from Arsenal. Into Turadam. Is he onside this time? Leno, good save. Obviously, Leno, formerly of Arsenal. Krizawa going to try and compete with him. Heavy touch. They drill the ball in. Good offending. And Krizawa does really well. Arsenal threatening. And team A for us. It's going to be our first chance of the game. Vinicius does really well. Playing in Solomon. Solomon's in one-on-one. -on -one. Mano Solomon. Fulham. From realistically doing nothing in this game. We take the lead versus Arsenal. 1-0. Mano Solomon with the goal. Vinicius with the assist. Love that. And it is 1-0 to us. Love that. Arsenal really threatening so far in these opening 14, 15 minutes with all them. But we get our first attack and we get our first goal. Mano Solomon, great finish as well. Past the American keeper, Matt Turner. 1-0. Chance here for Arsenal. They're going to immediately respond here. Saka into Odegaard. Odegaard back to Saka. And an instant response from Arsenal. one all here. 16 minutes gone. Saka with the gold. An instant response here from Arsenal. A bit of point we uh, toss in. Can imagine getting the inception on Odegaard. And he just lays it across to Saka. And Saka and pretty much an empty net to uh, tap in on to. 1-1. One, one. Nice play so far. Lukic and James. Lukic, James into Vinicius. Okay, we're trying to keep the ball. It's going to be a free kick. Which I'm actually going to take the free kick. Will Orban with the yellow card. I'll take the free kick and see if I can maybe potentially go to Dane. You know what? Let's let's be ambitious. I don't want to chip it. Let's see what we can do. Andrew Pereira now for Fulham. Andrew Pereira now from the free kick. Ah, it was dipping to be fair, but straight in the hands of Turner. And that's going to be half time. We go into the break. One all. Well, two very early goals. But honestly, I don't know if there's a replay to show after the two goals. There's been nothing. Nothing has happened, you know, apart from the goals. Honestly, I'm not even just saying that. Like, nothing's happened. I'm going to go check out the match facts right now. Four shots. I don't know where Arsenal got them four shots from. But, yeah, 1-1. Uh, one, one. That's it. Reed. Vinicius. Vinicius. Straight at Turner. I did see prayer. I should have maybe drilled it across. Solomon. I tried to close him off. They've still got it. Reed. Edge of the box. Turdam does really well. Turdam. 2-1 Arsenal on the hour mark. Marcus Turdam. <sighs> Dust. <laughs> right. 2-1 Arsenal. Man, oh, Solomon. Good run. Solomon. Wow. What an impact from Fulham. Two all. Man or Solomon. Let's go. Come on. He's done it again. He's done it again. He's done it again. Right. Love is there, Man or Solomon. We're going to make some subs. Declan Dover Reed's going to go to place James. And I think I'm going to bring on Robinson to place Kurosawa. Wow, come on, what response that I didn't see. I didn't expect that at all. We just found some big we just found a pocket of space. I ran into it. And what a finish from Solomon past Turner. Two all. Chance here now. Arsenal. Lovely run. And Arsenal. 
have made it 3-2. Zinchenko, a very unlikely goal scorer. I'm frustrated. It's annoying that we conceded three because I feel like we defended really well. Like, but it doesn't obviously look like that on paper, does it? But yeah, there we go. 3-2 uh, Arsenal. And all our hard work is undone. Could he maybe do something for us? Solomon. Lovely back heel. Robinson. Left side. Robinson, get that ball in. It falls to Reed. Reed, one touch. Bang. Blocked. Chance to aid as well. Oh, good challenge there. Toss in. Oh, lovely football there. So from Fulham, we might be in. Chance to maybe seal the game. Vinicius in. Vinicius. No. Oh. Good save. I don't know why it's in sealed the game. Equalised the game. Mino de Galaxy coming on. Corner kick. Pereira whips the ball in. Toss it. Diving header. Knocked away. And Arsenal. They don't get rid of it far. To a edge of the box. Reed. Dink that ball in. Oh, cleared. Oh, okay, they lose the ball, Arsenal. It's going to be a good chance. Final minute now. Pereira. Ah, oh, good chance ever by. We fought till the end in this game, which is what I'm proud of. If we lose a game, I want us to lose the game fighting and, you know, putting um, everything into the game because I think we've done really well. We might actually have one last chance here. Solomon, Pereira. It's a malicious. Nice football. No, I want to play back to Pereira, man. And full time. We deserve so much better than that. 3-2 Arsenal full-time. Let's head into the next game against our London rivals, Chelsea. Okay, so our next game of the season. Uh, not too many changes to the lineup. Only one change to the side which lost against Arsenal. Robinson has good base Kuzawa. I don't know what to do. I'm going to talk to you about this situation that I've got at the moment. Kuzawa and Robinson are both... Not Robinson. Kuzawa and Cedric are both on loan. And I've recently had emails saying, I need to play them more or they're going to leave. Um, so let me know your thoughts in the comments. Do you think I should play them more and give them more game time and try and give them a chance to stay here and try and keep them in for the rest of the loan? Or do you think we should play them as we please and see if we get lucky that we can manage to be able to keep them uh, till the end of the season? Or do you think we should potentially be looking at new left backs and right backs to bring in as backup or competition? But anyway, we've got the game here against Chelsea away. Going to be a difficult game. Obviously, a London rivalry between both of these sides. Uh, we did lose in the FL Cup. I'm hoping to try and uh, not have a similar fate here. I believe we um, can do really well against Chelsea. Um, I think we really did well against them last time. And I actually am very confident in this Fulham team that we can go on to win this game. And hopefully end our losing run of two consecutive games. Let's take on Chelsea. Come on, Fulham. Chance of a Chelsea. Got them on the edge of the box. Chance. Good block. Rebound. Blocked again. They've still got it. And it somehow found its way in. 1-0 Chelsea. What's that, about 25 minutes gone? Not too much has happened, really. And, um, yeah, that's really his point. That was brilliant defence there from us again. But it's just... I don't know. Like, I don't want to sound salty here, but the luck. You know, like, look at that. We block. We do really well, and it somehow still falls to them, and he's, they somehow have to get their shot off, and it's 1-0 Chelsea. Shares that wide to James. Our first chance of the game, maybe. James down, spread forward. Come on, Daniel James. James is in, one-on-one. -on -one. Daniel James! Great save from Mendy. Rebound knocked away from Chelsea. Chance of a Chelsea. They may be in with Sterling. Toss in, trying to catch it with Sterling. Sterling. That's too much. It does really well. Pereira, lovely play. Lays off to Lukic. One minute of any time. Lukic! Oh, straight in the throw of Mendy. And that's going to be that. 1-0 Chelsea as we go into the break. We played really well. Chammy goal. <laughs> and, um, yeah. 1-0 Chelsea. Chance him over Chelsea. Sterling. Sterling doing really well. Trying to catch up with him. Falls to Aubameyang. But imagine they're going to try and drill it across. They left to Sterling. Sterling, James, oh, not too far off, I'm going to make some subs, um, I'm going to bring on Dekodova Reed to replace, uh, Vinicius, I know, and I'm going to bring on Willian to replace Solomon, and I'm also going to bring on Harry Wilson to replace Pereira, so a triple change, because, honestly, by the way this game's going, nothing's happening, like, honestly, there's been nothing you know, apart from the goal. It's been a really uneventful game so far. Still 1-0 Chelsea, however. 
And for Chelsea, James down on the right side. James doing really well. Ball in. Chad Sia. Save from Leno. EA need to fix this scoreboard issue. It's been going on for way too long. Alright. Chance here. Pereira. We may be in. Pereira. Chance here for us. Andreas. Pereira. Wide. Actually, no, it isn't Pereira. It's Wilson. Two for Chelsea. Mount is off. And who are they bringing on? Ziyech. Oh, chance here for us. Wilson's in. One on one. Harry Wilson now for Fulham. Wilson! Let's go. One all at the bridge. Come on. Let's go. One on Chelsea Fulham. Let's get this winner. Come on. Great stuff, Barry Wilson. One all just over the hour mark. Love that. Come on. 1-1. One, one. Oh, no. Oh, it's off. It's so frustrating. It really is. It's irritating. We have been all over Chelsea. And look how jammy that is. Like, I'm looking into the post, but why is nobody there to, like, mark him and clear the rebound too on Chelsea? <sighs> Give me a red card. It's it's so biased. Red card, tossed out of a bio. I don't know whether that's a red or not. You guys can make up your mind on that, I guess. But, yeah, it, it's frustrating, really. It's frustrating. Ream's going to come on. Red card, we're down to 10. I, I don't know. Maybe I'm being biased, but I don't think that's a red. <laughs> Bring on Ken. He's placed Lukic as well. A bit more attacking. Corner kick. Wilson. Whip that ball in, son. Tete! Great save. Rebound! No, Mendy! Gets there first, and that's going to be that. Come on. Nah, I mean, Chelsea have done enough here. They might be able to actually potentially. I don't want to concede another goal. Sterling of Jao Felix. Felix gets it from Kenny, and that's going to be that. Full time, 2 1 Chelsea. Another defeat. Three defeats in a row. In all fairness, though, the Southampton one I felt was a bit frustrating, but the last two games, they're very good teams in FIFA, Chelsea and Arsenal. But we got Leicester at home next. I'm not going to lie, we need to win that, or at least something. I don't know. We need to win. Before we get into the next game here, I want to show you guys our Youth Academy. I want to know if there's anybody here that you guys think I should promote or not. Um, honestly, because I know we haven't had a look at it for a few things now. We've kind of changed countries too. Uh, we did just have one to come back. It's Alessandro Araujo from Brazil. This kid looks like, looks in really good. But I think he's more of a striker looking at them stats right there. But our Youth Academy looks incredible, honestly. What a youth can we? This one, the players I'm excited about as well. Oscar Taylor, 60 overall at 15 years of age, 81 potential to 94 is very good. Obviously, we got a lot of young goalkeepers here. Um, this guy, uh, Kirk Patrick, also looks very good as well. Another uh, youngster from Scotland that we have decided to uh, promote to the youth team, as well as this youngster here, Santos. He's probably a bit more of a centre mid rather than a cam, but. Still a pretty all right player. And Pinto, who looks very good as well. Who is also a striker rather than a uh, right winger. Just because of his really promising uh, shooting. But yeah, really good youth academy. Changes the lineup here. As we can take on Leicester, we've been forced to make a change through Tim Ream. We started bringing in Decordova Reed as well. So Decordova Reed and Ream both come in. Uh, Reed replaces James, and Ream comes in to place the suspended tossing at Rabayo. But anyway, let's get his game us in Leicester City, and hopefully we could try and pick up a win after three losses. Well, actually, I think we haven't won in the last five games, actually. That's a bit mad, actually, when you think about it. Wow. I didn't realise it was that uh, bad. Because, like I said, we obviously... Um, I'm trying to think now. Because we lost to Southampton. We drew to City. We drew to Palace. Not looking good there. But then again... So, actually, we do need to win this game, kind of. Let's take on Leicester and see what Leicester City have got. 
Oh, Dan could never read. Now he's on the right side. Chance here, maybe for us. Finishes. It we hit the post. Wow, really close right there. Good save from the Leicester goalkeeper, which I don't believe that is warding net, but a really positive start from us here. We got ourselves a corner. We're going to try and whip the ball in. Pereira, not a bad delivery. Vinicius trying to get under it. Knocked away. Falls to Luke. It's chest volley. Actually, it's Iverson. Chance here for Leicester out wide. Madison, right side. They're cutting it back. Mooney round nicely. Tillemans. Nice play so far. Shot from distance. Good block. Leicester City with their first chance. It's a hey, making good run into Pereira. Pereira. Go try to through to Vinicius. Vinicius is in one-on-one. -on -one. Vinicius! Is this his first goal of the season? <laughs> I don't know. But 1 0 full of Leicester. Vinicius with the goal. Who hasn't really cut it recently, filling uh, Mitrovic's boots. But yeah, lovely play from us right there. Pereira into Vinicius. 1 1 with the keeper. Vinicius does well to get that underneath Iverson. 1 0 full of And that is Vinicius' first goal, yeah, of the Premier League. Chance maybe for Leicester. We lose possession. Tete's in. Tete! Seriously. 1-1. One, one. Leicester a level. Tete with a goal. I'm a little bit annoyed we haven't kept a clean sheet in this series yet. I'm really annoyed that we haven't kept a clean sheet yet. Because I've been a lot better defending if I pretend this Cremo than having any of the others. 1-1. One, one. Lukic Pereira. Oh, beautiful. 2-1 Fulham. Back in front. Instant response. Pereira with the goal. I'm having no mercy in. I'm happy we're in a lot more clinical with the chances we're taking. You know, I was a little bit worried with that. Obviously, when Lukic, you know, from distance went wide. Obviously, finished it hitting the post early on. But great fish there from Pereira. Just low into the bottom left corner. Let's go. 2-1 Fulham. Back in front. Chance he made for Leicester. Indeedy. Back out wide. Tete. Left side. Tete. Doing well. Ball dinked in. Diop as well. I don't know if that's the chance gone. I think it might be. Yeah. Got chance he made for Leicester. Coming forward. I'm not sure who this is. Looks like a youngster. Knocked out of play. Another throw near to Leicester again. Tillemans, 30 yards out here, out wide to Tete, it's Tete v Tete, just for the break, good challenge, falls to Reed, Reed blasts the upfield, and that's half time, 2-1 Fulham, let's go. Oh no, 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 Madison, oh great block from Diop, great defending there from Issa Diop. He, does, he deserves all the clean. He said Diop has been phenomenal in this series. He's been so good. Okay, we've got us a free kick in a pretty threatening position here. Pereira, we tried it last time with him. It didn't really work out. Um, so I don't really see the point of trying it again. But you know what? We are going to try it again. Pereira now. Going to go for it. Up and over the wall. Oh, roof of the net. Not far off from Pereira. Oh, chance of a Leicester. They might be in. Tillemans. Laid off. Shot. Save Leno. Rebound. Oh, no. Oh, great defend from Diop again. Chance, maybe. Leno. Big save. We are holding on. We've approached the last 10 minutes. I'm going to make some subs. I'm tempted to bring on our youngster, Harris, but I don't think I'm going to. I'm going to bring on Cedric to replace Tete. I'm going to bring on James for that quick counter-attack in. And you know what? I'm going to bring on the youngster, Harris. His first Premier League game. Oh, here we go. Come on. Come on, Fulham. Chance of a Leicester. Oh, they get it all wrong and we get rid of it. We won't be able to counter that though with Dan James. 
James now versus the Leicester defense. Oh, beautiful stuff from Dan James. Oh, beautiful. Come on, Dan James. Come on. Run at the heart of the defense. Dan James for Fulham. It's a beautiful run. And Fulham might have just sealed it. Counter-attacking football at its best. 3-1 Fulham. Daniel James take a bow. He's been on the pitch barely a minute. And he might have just sealed it for Fulham. Come on. Okay, Leicester might be able to get a constellation goal here with Tate into Vardy. Challenge dream. Two minutes of eight time. Wow. What a way to return back to winning ways here against Leicester City. We've been brilliant in this game. Defensively, offensively, clinical, which I rarely say about this team being really clinical. You know, but anyway, there we go. 3-1 Fulham and full time. Great win. Come on. Before we end up the episode, we're going to put our youngster, Alessandro Araujo, which might get a few games, you know, because if anybody didn't know, obviously Mitrovic is still out for a little bit of time, so he has potential to be special, Araujo. This guy, or Araujo, I'm not sure, you I'm not sure how you would pronounce his name, obviously it's Brazilian. So, uh, I mean, obviously in Brazil, they speak Portuguese, if I'm not wrong. So, yeah. Uh, but anyway, 6-6 six, six overall at 17. This kid could really be something for us. And that's how we are going to end off the episode. That is how we are going to end off the episode here. We currently sit in ninth in the league. 15 points, 4 wins, 3 draws, 4 losses. Uh, but anyway... Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of the Fulham Crew. If you guys have, make sure to drop a like, subscribe. Next episode in the episode 5, if you're not here, it's episode 5. We do have Spurs, Man United and Everton. Difficult games, but you know what? I think we can beat them. But anyway, everybody, take care. Have a great day. Speak to you soon. See you later, people.